Hi, Robert Galarowitz, creator of the All Natural Kidney Health and Kidney Function Restoration Program. And today I want to talk about some good things that you can do to help your kidney disease. Now, behind me, a study came out in the Clinical Journal of the American Society of Nephrology, November 2012. And this study was done in renal transplants, but they also have studies just like this for uh, people who don't have transplants, who just have kidney disease without, without having any type of uh, renal kidney transplant. Now, what they found was that people who do have uh, kidney transplants is at a 30% higher risk of developing acidosis. Now, acidosis roughly is when too much acid builds up in the body. And when too much acid builds up in the body, it's going to worsen your kidney function and speed up the loss of kidney function. So this is definitely something you want to avoid. And it's, there's a higher percentage of this in people with transplants because of the anti-rejection drugs that you have to take. And sometimes the transplants don't always work that good, along with other complications increases this risk. And what they found in the study was that some dietary things that you can do helped reduce the chances of acidosis and also reduce the severity of it. So if you did get it, it wasn't as bad as um, if you ate these other foods and did other things that you, you know, really shouldn't do with the transplant. So roughly what they recommended in the study was to reduce meats, fish, and cheese in the diet. Okay, and they found that people who had more of this in their diet had an increased risk. And when you get the acidosis with a renal transplant, it's just not going to last as long. And so you want to avoid that at all costs. Uh, if you do get it, it can be corrected. You know, there's ways to go about that. But prevention is always the best, uh, the best benefit. So if you have a renal transplant, you want to limit or avoid meats, fish, and cheese. And you want to consume more fruits and vegetables. And that's what the study showed. By consuming more of these fruits and vegetables, People were able to avoid the acidosis and, in essence, extend the life of their kidney transplant. Now, I have another, another video on my YouTube channel which talks about this similar concept applying to people who didn't have transplants who just had kidney disease. You can take a look at that. There's some foods that I actually list in on what you want to consume. So just click over to that link, like, comment this video. Thanks for watching. This is Robert Galarowitz, creator of the All Natural Kidney Health and Kidney Function Restoration Program at HealKidneyDisease.com. That's www.HealKidneyDisease.com. Thanks for watching. Bye.